What's good, DT Squad? It's your boy Damien. Back at you with another rest. Hey, today we got my girl J Lo in the building. We be ready to dance again. Now, J Lo is somebody we have never read to yet on this channel, which is shocking to me. But it's another step into the DT Squad fan base. You know, it'll bring J Lo fan base. Fan fans over to the channel as well as it did like Ariana Grande, uh, Justin Bieber, Glee, uh, K Rhino, some other and some other uh, artists, Selena Gomez. But before we get into the video, make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe, and turn your post notifications on to be up to date. But when I make a new video, all right, now let's get into it. Before we get to it, I had the biggest crush on J-Lo growing up. I think up until my, like, my teenage years, upper teenage years. Yeah. I thought she was the, the dream of my life. Things changed. <laughs> And this song is powerful by the way. It's a lot of women want to touch you tonight. I'm a big girl. But a lot of secrets. Secrets tonight? Or no secrets tonight? I don't know. Meaning, hey. She's saying this one man came into the club or wherever they at. I'm saying club. Come me me as a club. This one man came in the club. Man down. Right? Every woman looking at him. But she like I'm, I'm the one that's gonna get him tonight. Now I'm pulling out secrets that he never seen before. Gonna be on like Donkey Kong. As y'all know, J Lo pull a lot of men. No cap. <laughs> We've seen it over the what, past twenty years, ten years, fifteen years. I mean, how many years you wanna say? Question for y'all, these squad. Who y'all think dancing? Who y'all think winning dance battle? J Lo and Beyonce. Who y'all think? If I had to choose, <laughs> it'd be close. Damn. I give J Lo the the uh, the top position. And I, I give it a 95 
to J Lo. And ninety two, ninety ninety to Beyonce. So I think J Lo will win it by hair. Not, she might not win the same. It's my opinion. Just over the years where I seen the number of dance. Uh, she in a tiger uh, position now. The crowns are like fireworks. You're not a fan of J-Lo? Get off my channel, bro. Because, hey, J-Lo's been irre irrelevant since, what, early 2000s, the mid, the 2010s, and she ain't really done the music like 2020 and up. I think she got an album might be coming up soon, and I don't know, I'm not sure, but... She's one of my favorite female singers of all times. Like if I had to put her in my books, she'd be in my top ten for sure. Now top five, maybe yeah, maybe no, but she's up there. She's always been one of my favorite female singers growing up. Every time she make an album, I I click on really fast just to find it and just listen to every music, every song on the album fast as I can. That, that's how crazy a fan I am of her. Mr. Worldwide in the world. Mr. Worldwide. Ah, oh, that's her ex. And he's still her dancer, I think. I think about it, she got one of the craziest dance uh she got choreographers. She got one of the craziest choreographers, she got one of the dan the craziest backup dancers. Like growing up I wanted to be a backup dancer, Chris Brown. It was just one of my dreams. Yeah. Well my my first dream was to become a NASCAR racer. Or a wrestler. And it went from that to monster truck driver to like a fisherman. Then it went from that to football or basketball. Then soccer, tackle dancer, and so on. Now, now it's just a YouTuber, entrepreneur, investing in different companies like. Apple, uh, Google, whatever. Maybe the yeah, uh, L.A. Lakers. You know, still like that. And I want to build my own club line, and maybe open up a couple of workout stores. Well, workout grocery stores around the whole world. If it if it goes well, I open up like twenty five tops, like the twenty five biggest cities in the United States. 
So yeah, that's my dream right now. It's been my dream for a while now. And I'm not going to go on, on these dreams. That's for a fact. Because I know where they can take me in life. I'm going to keep on pushing and hustling to where I get to keep, where I got to get to. When I get to that point, there's no stopping me. I'm going to keep on going to the top. All right? Why she's so beautiful, huh? Why? Why? And then she's like, what, 50 years old and still look like this? Crazy. Pops up, bro. Jennifer Lopez! That's why I never heard of this man. I mean, this, uh, so, week 10. Is it in Greece or just they're just a fan base name? Wherever it is, just let me know in the comments, cuz I never heard of Wheat Wheaton. I don't know where that's at. They gotta be in a different country, cause I ain't never heard of it. In the United States. I don't know. We'll find out. Dance again! In Kürze wird sie bei uns hier auf der Couch sitzen. Herzlichen yeah. Dank. Das ist eine Großartige Nummer. Jennifer Lopez, meine Damen und Herren. Im Moment auf großer Welttournee. See you later. Thank you so much. Vier Termine auch hier in Deutschland. Vier große Städte werden sie auch hier in oh, Deutschland sehen. Ja, und wir schauen. Moment. I was looking around, see who was talking. That's sorry. Okay. All right, DT Squad, that's the end of this video. Hope y'all enjoyed this video, like, as much as I did. Like I said, J-Lo is one of my favorite artists, female artists. Worldwide, and it has changed since 2000. What nine, ten? That's when I really started getting to her music. I know about it, like 2002, 2001. But y'all know what to do. Y'all want me to direct more J Lo music? Comment down below and tell me what song y'all want me to react to, and I put on the list. And we'll go over there. All right. Well, it's the end of the video. Y'all know, do make sure to like, share, comment, subscribe, tell your folks about the channel, and follow me on all my social media. they be down the link below. Okay. So I'm Damien with DT Squad. I'm out. Hey, y'all. Uh...